Welcome to Back to the Bible. Devotions for this Christmas season is Journey to Bethlehem. Journey to Bethlehem, we want to see the baby. We want to see the baby. That's what people say in hospital corridors, at church or wherever they see an infant. Oh, look at her tiny hands and she's got such long fingers. She'll probably play the piano. Now look at those broad little shoulders. It looks like as if you have got a football player here. Why do people want to see the baby? What force drives them to look searchingly at an infant's tiny face? Maybe it's meaning. When you see a baby, do you notice only the amount and shade of the hair? The resemblance to relatives, the captivating smile, or do you look beyond and ponder the child's promise and potential? Another baby claims her attention every Christmas season. One born in a manger nearly 2,000 years ago, the baby Jesus. We can't literally gaze into his face today, but we know enough about him to realize that the meaning of his life is crucial to meaning in our lives. Let's take an imaginary journey to Bethlehem in search of new meanings in the life of the baby born. There so long ago, we'll renew our acquaintance with people from Bible days and learn more about that anticipation of and search for that same child. Francis Ridley Havergrill said, Jesus came and came for me simple words and yet expressingly depths of holy mystery, depths of wondrous love and blessing. Holy Spirit, make me see all his coming means to me. Take the things of Christ, I pray, show them to my heart today. Let's see the verse for today. It's Psalms 42 verses 1 and 2. As the deer pants for the water brook, so pants my soul for you, O God. My soul thirsts for God, for the living God. Your steps for today. Determined to be consistent in your devotions time this month. Set aside a time and a place to meditate and pray each day. For today, write down one thing that the life and death of this baby born in Bethlehem means to you. And pray for today. Ask the Lord for a thirst for Him. Ask Him to make your devotions during this Christmas season very profitable. God bless you.